right now but I do want to dip my toe in it a little bit so today it's not really going to be shopping for me but shopping for you guys so I'm going to put all my links like my Depop and everything so you can shop if you want to the prices aren't going to be like outrageously expensive it's going to be pretty affordable and enough for me to make a profit so if you guys are interested you can check that out but this is going to be the video today of me shopping for my Depop shop All right, y'all, so this portion of the video is sponsored by Timu. If you haven't heard of Timu, where have you been? It's honestly like a bit of a hit or miss for people. Some people think it's a scam. Some people shop on Timu often. I'm one of those people. This is my second time shopping on Timu. Obviously, I have the products right now to show y'all that it's not a scam. So if you guys want to shop, I'll have the link and everything in my description. And also, if I have a code, I'll put it on the screen and I'll also keep it in my description as well so you guys can see this lighting that i'm using right now look look how i look without it this is from timu and look how i look with the light you're gonna need one of these if you do a lot of recording and stuff and you need that good good light because this is providing the good good light so the next thing i want to show you guys is these chanclas that i have they're like a ugg dupe but they're more of like a house slipper they're not really meant to be worn outside i love these they're super comfortable super soft and they make me feel so bougie like when i'm walking around my house in my little chanclas like yes this is really random but i got underwear which i don't really know if i should be showing my underwear online but here they are. I got a white pair and a blue pair. We're not gonna talk too much about it. Y'all know where it goes. Y'all know how underwear works. I'll also have the price for everything on the screen so you guys can see why you should be shopping on Timu. It's super, super cheap, like unbelievably cheap. Like why is it this cheap? Next thing I got is some socks. You know, you can't go wrong with socks. These are like cute little knitted socks. So I have this burnt orange color, this brown color, this cream color, this white color, this yellow color, and and black of course and these were super cheap they all came in a pack of six if you ever need some socks and you have time to wait because obviously it's gonna take a little bit of time to get to you y'all know where to go this is more underwear feels so awkward showing it online but i have to show it because this is sponsored and i need to show you guys what i got i got these green panties okay don't look too hard because i'm already embarrassed showing my underwear online damn shame i haven't worn them yet so maybe that'll make me feel better Next, I got this little pack of like makeup stuff. So first is like the little headband to hold back your hair when you're doing your makeup. And then it comes with the little arm sleeves. This is for when you're washing your face so the water doesn't like drip down your arm. If you know, you know. It comes with two obviously, because most people have two hands. And then in this, it comes with like a little powder puff that you hold like that. And then it comes with the beauty blender and like a tiny powder puff as well. The last thing that I have in this little bag is these little sports bra thingies. They're like little bralettes. And I'm gonna take the little padding out, but it does come with padding if you like padding. So I got this burnt orange color, this brown color, and then this like dark brown color. And those all came in a pack too. Next thing I'm gonna show y'all is this cup that I got. It's supposed to be like the Stanley dupe. Obviously I love pink. Look at my water bottle, look at my coffee cup. And now I got this cup, also in pink. Um, it comes with a little straw and I also did get one of those cute straw covers, but we're gonna have to get to that. I'm not gonna be digging for that. One thing though, it did come broken. That's like a little bit sad. Well, I'm just gonna keep it. It's sad that it's broken, but hey, what can you do? Nothing. Next I got my mom these chanclas. They're gingerbread chanclas. Isn't that so adorable? They're for Christmas. They're not a Christmas gift. They're just Christmas slippers. In this bag, I have like accessories. I have this bangle. This bangle that I'm wearing right now, this gold one, is from my last team order and I got like another one. So I have this like thinner one. 
one. Probably just gonna wear that today. Then I got a pack of razors for your eyebrows, you know, your little mustache, because we all got them. Then I have this little thing, which is for when you're washing your face to really, you know, get in there. So it has like these little gritty things on it. And then this is for like face masks, so you could dip it in the product. You wanna, you don't gotta get stuff under your nails. Then I got me some makeup brushes, cause at my job you have to wear makeup, so I needed some more brushes. I also got some dupe makeup products, but they sent me the wrong shades, unfortunately. But yeah, I got this little blush thing. I see a lot of people use blushes like this. I don't know what this is a dupe of specifically, but look, not my shade at all like at all this is gonna literally make me look like a ghost clown so never gonna use that but hey team you got it if you want it and then i got a dior lip glow dupe but they again did not send me the right shade i'm gonna have to mix it with other things this is still usable because it's not that bad it's just not really the color that i wanted just put a little bit it is cute and it does look exactly like the lip glow so that's cool i also got some jewelry so i got this infinity ring super cute another ring this one's rose gold that it's nice i just don't really love rose gold this is a little box cutter for when i get my packages and it's like a little cloud how cute is that it's so cute so cute and then i got these little earrings they're, they're simple and then this was the straw cover that I was talking about. It's a little cloudy, it's a little smiley face. I have another ring. This is actually like a duo kind of thing. And it's a heart. So cute. I think I put it on wrong. Guys, I literally have more stuff. Hold on. This is the last of it though. So I got this little tote bag to hold my work stuff. Because I don't want to keep bringing my Marc Jacobs tote bag because it's so big. And I don't need a bag that big. And then I also got this one, which I think is gonna be better than the big one because the cubbies at my job are small and I didn't know that. So I'm gonna be carrying this bag like to carry my work stuff in, like my purse, my wallet, all that to put in my cubby. And that's it. That's the Timu haul. Like I said, y'all, I'll have the link and everything, my code and all that in the description if you guys wanna shop on Timu. Give it a chance, give it a shot. You don't have to do a big order like I did. You can do like, you know, a little bit just to see if the stuff gets sent to your house which it will guys like it's okay but yeah if you guys want to use my code as well if i have a code i'll leave it in the description or on the screen and back to our regularly scheduled programming these were originally 40 dollars the air fossils still have the tag on they're 15 dollars. that's kind of expensive for goodwill <laughs> like the rack of clothes that they haven't put out yet this is a good life hack if you want to find cool stuff like this juicy that's cute i don't know who's gonna wear this but you're gonna look so good when you do and i also found this juicy top too with tags who donated the juicy collection Surprisingly, I didn't have any luck in the jean short section or jean section at this Goodwill. And that's one of the things that I know, well, that I used to know would always be there no matter what. They would have good jeans and good shorts. But today, I don't know. They really didn't have anything that I was looking for or anything that I gravitate towards. Ooh, jump scare. Uh, uh, uh. Yeah, that's <laughs> ugly as hell. What the hell is that? all the jeans were really picked over i think maybe because i came a little bit later in the day that's why or they just didn't really have any good stuff around the time that i went that what's that pull, pull that one out the white one Sheen? Why is Sheen bad? Guys, tell me why Sheen is bad. Shit, sure, y'all don't know you. I go on this spiel literally every single time I make a thrifting video. I talk yeah. about how annoying it is to find Sheen 
at thrift stores because it's literally clothes that was just that people just bought for like two dollars off of Shein, where the people who make the clothes are are literally getting paid pennies, mm. and it's like ten year olds working illegally to make your stupid two dollar jacket that's not even good quality that's literally made out of microplastics. You're literally wearing tubware on your body. Mm. If you didn't know, that's what polyester is literally plastic. Yeah, we're boycotting sheen. Like, there's absolutely no way we should be finding this much sheen in the thrift store when this clo these clothes literally just came out online. Why are they already at the thrift store? Like, I need to be seeing 28-year-old clothes here, not two-month-old clothes. Like, no. Stop, stop over-shopping, guys, because you're the reason why my thrifting experience is declining. I pretty much got my Goodwill figured out. I know where to look to find specific types of clothing. Like if I want to find velour jackets or track pants, then I usually look in like the athletic wear section, which is the section I'm looking in right now. And if they do have a jacket or a pant, it's going to be there. If they don't, it's not. I just don't think I had the best of luck. Actually, I did find some cool stuff. I can't lie. But for like the specific stuff that I seek out, maybe the girls got it before I could. So would you guys buy this on Depop? That's kind of nice. That's nice. Yeah, put it in there. Yeah. So I decided that I want to do Depop for fun right now and just see how it goes. There's this girl that I watch here on YouTube, July Hampton. She's a full-time Depop seller, so she's like in it, in it. And she posts like her process of buying the clothes, taking the pictures and all that stuff. And I used to sell Depop clothes when I was in college and it was something fun for me to do. Like I really do enjoy it and I thrift so much. I come across so many cute things and if I could control like who it's going to and how it gets there i feel like that's gonna be really fun for me so right now i'm not doing it like as my job but as like kind of like a side hustle and also a hobby at the same time because it's gonna be something that's gonna be fun for me especially because i thrift so much this is juicy but this is new juicy you can tell by the tag the older stuff has like pink tags orange tags stuff like that but this is new so i don't think i'm gonna get it plus it's just a plain gray sweatshirt I guess this is the time that I can take to kind of define the style that I'm going to be selling on Depop, which is literally going to be my style. So everything that I would wear, I'm going to put it on my Depop if it's something that's like not my size or something that I personally don't need in my closet. But it's something that I would wear, then I'm going to put it on my Depop. So if you guys have been liking my videos and you like the style of clothes that I thrift, then you're going to like what I put on my Depop because I'm not really going to change that. I feel like a lot of people's depop shops are just like their style or what they know is gonna sell and i'm gonna do both i'm gonna do my style and what i know is gonna sell i'm gonna have like a lot of early 2000 inspired pieces and as well as 90s because i'm like in between those two and some trendier items i'm online a lot so i am aware of things that are trending so i'll know kind of how to maneuver and what to put on my shop that will most likely sell because again i'm not trying to have like a bunch of stuff sitting that's not my goal at all like i want to put it up and sell it quickly fairly quickly i don't know if i'm asking for too much because i'm new to this but i know i would be blessed yeah what, what is that i don't know and i don't know what brand it is
the hell is that? This, this, I don't even know what this is, but wouldn't it be nice to hold a wine bottle? What? Ooh, that's gas. What is it? Let me see. Let me see the it's top. It's a CNN news source. What? You, what did they put the, the information like in there? Scroll. Yeah, like a <laughs> scroll. <laughs> Oh, no. That's so funny. I've never seen anything like this. I'm not gonna lie, I'm Look, surprised how they keep the these shoes clean. Y2K baby fat wedges. No. That's kind of cool. Yeah. Not, I wouldn't wear it, but nah. it's cool. But how many inches do you think that there's at least like three or four? Yeah. Damn, definitely. girl. <laughs> there's, I have so, now, so now I know why y'all women be wanting men that are six feet and taller. Because when you put them heels on, sheesh, I'm telling you. <laughs> You're commentary. Yeah. Look, somebody already donated. Bro, you better put my, some of my commentary on your video, too. Oh, I'm going to leave it in. You send the, are you gonna leave it in? Yeah. Yes, sir. Do <laughs> sit down side by. You never popping out with a man? She lying, y'all. See, I'm right here. I'm right here. <laughs> I'm right here in the flesh. Mm, oh, whoa, 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 whoa! What are you doing? But you remember that jacket you got? Yeah, bingo! Yeah, pull it out. Pull it out. I know. Pull it out though. Pull it out. Yes, sir. That would be so gas. Imagine like you put cheap. that jacket on with that, and then you have the boots, the Timberland. You got some like nice Timberland boots. You don't see the vision. I don't it's have okay, Timberland bro. Boots. That's what I'm saying. Never back down. Never what? Never give up. Exactly. Oh, okay. I see what you're doing. <laughs> no, you don't get it because you're not on TikTok, bro. His for you pages, <laughs> Wow. Hey, listen, yo. I just got on TikTok like a couple weeks ago. Don't blame me. <laughs> He's such a grandpa. I really am, yo. I was asking her like, yo, how do you work this? How you do this? How you do that? <laughs> you don't even know how to save a TikTok to your job. Bro, chill, bro. I know how to do that now. <laughs> Listen, y'all. I don't like social media, but you know, sometimes you need it for business and all of that. Money. Oh, that's so cute. That's not cute, but put that the back. Button. The button? Yeah, just the button. That's all I'm see. saying is keep the button. Yeah, it's nice, you know. That's at least uh, 10K on 70s that. 70s vibes. Yeah. Uh-huh. A lot of your aunties rock that button. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Yeah. 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 I'm not gonna lie, subs. She really put me on the thrift thing. Cause I did not know you could find good shit at the thrift store. You know what I'm saying? And in these hard times, you gotta you gotta find the best available price you can look for. You know, it's not bad. For the women. For the women it's not bad. For the men, I don't know, but we out of luck, y'all boys. Cause we can't find anything. They don't have nothing like this for us, man. But for them, they got everything. See how they be doing the subs. It's all good, man. I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. You took over my whole video. I take over your video. I'm I, just adding some oh sauce my to gosh. it. This is ridiculous. What? Was it Shin? Oh hell no. Go ahead, make the fart noise. Make the <laughs> 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 yes, sir. We don't do that around here. Nah. That's a lot. I never really see that much. In, um, today's like the most I've seen. Don't you have like a skirt leather thing just like that? Or no? No, I don't have a leather oh. skirt actually. I thought you did. This is something Ooh, my mom would wear. This is gas. Pretty nice. That's gas. What are you talking you about? Look at this. All of this section, all for women. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. And we just and we just came from that section over there. So they got all of this stuff over here. And they got these grandma dresses. Like, I don't understand, yo. What a bumba. It's like a 70s. No. It's cute. No. <laughs> me don't, me don't like. Oh, Lord, have mercy. That's not bad. I ain't gonna lie. That's not bad. Feel it. That's not bad. Let me feel that. 
soft. Yeah, it's soft. It's not bad. Uh, why does it zip down the coochie? I wish it was like. No, it zips down the coochie. Why does it do that? I don't know. Nah. That's something you only wear for me. Not when you go out. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? Why is you know the mean? camera so. <laughs> <laughs> what if no. I wear this? Oh, God. I wouldn't yeah. walk with you. I promise you, you walking by yourself. Some people, this is their style. Also, guys, let me know how you feel about like the live commentary. If you watch my videos, you know I usually just voice over and mute all of the footage that I actually recorded. Today, I did like a little mixture of both live and voice over. So just let me know how we're feeling about that. And also, obviously, I have somebody with me that you can hear loud and clear. So yeah, we not gonna we not gonna get into that. Let's look at the lingerie. Oh, my right. subbies know I love looking in the lingerie mm. so cute. I wonder why. <laughs> cute. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Guess what it is. Go ahead, let me hear it. These are all my finds. I found this little lace top that I did not get. I passed on it. Then I found these BB track pants. I definitely got these. But low key, I want to keep them for myself. Which I'm going to because they're just too cute. Then I found this like bedazzled velour BCBG jacket. It has so many rhinestones on it. It's so cool. I think it's going to be perfect on my Depop. I found this pink off the shoulder top which is very trendy. But it was $10. So I pass on it because why is it $10? Then I found this cute little workup top that I was going to get for myself. But I pass on it because I really don't need any more workout clothes. It will be cute though. And then I found this guest mini skirt. It's super mini. And I think it's going to be so good on my Depop. It matches the vibes so well. And of course the juicy stuff that I found. I think it's going to be so nice. I, I love Juicy Couture. This isn't something I personally would wear. Which is why I'm not keeping it. But it's new with tags. Juicy new with tags like OG made in America juicy such a good find and these were a good find too I've never seen anything like it but I think it's gonna be perfect for like coquette girlies you know what I mean oh it's so cute not for me but for someone else and those were all my finds thank you guys so much for watching I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you guys in my next video I'll be your